Yo, what's going on out there everybody? It's Roll Easy here and I'm back with another video and I'm gonna explain everything you need to know about this DM glitch. I've heard your concerns, I've heard your questions, I know what you guys are struggling with and guess what, I'm here to help you, okay? So, what you're gonna need for this, and by the way, all the founders will be in the description, this is about you guys, okay? So I'm gonna help everybody out that's been struggling with this glitch and there's a lot of you, but I've been able to get a lot of successful outfits going and you know what, you can too. But I'm going to help you out, alright? So, here we go. What you're going to need for this glitch is you need your online character to uh, to be set to, you know, spawn location set to random. You need him to only be wearing, I'd say, maybe a crew t-shirt and a forward cap. We've confirmed that you do not need a rebreather. That is totally optional. If you want to do it with a rebreather, you can. I've used both. Without and with a rebreather, it works both ways. So, you need that. And along with that, you also need two bird peyotes. We've confirmed that the dogs do work, but there's more stress on your system, okay? When you're using dogs and you're duplicating dogs because they're bigger. So you want to use two birds, all right? If you look at my last video, I show you the locations of the two bird peyotes that I ate in story mode, all right? So make sure you have that ready to go. Um, I also want to confirm that blue and white joggers are confirmed to be working. Well, at least white joggers for certain. Because on my Twitter, go check out my Twitter, link is in the description. I have three screenshots that were sent to me of people wearing white joggers that were obtained through this glitch. So go ahead and check that out on Twitter if you guys don't believe me. But it, there is proof right there. Okay, so now you see me with my online character. You want to be wearing a normal outfit, non-glitched whatsoever. And rank doesn't matter either, Either okay? I know my last video I said you have to be rank 80. You don't, all right? But check it out. Spawn location set to random. Apart from that, just be wearing a forward cap, rebreather or not, doesn't matter, and normal clothing. I recommend actually just having a crew t-shirt on, just some jeans and a pair of shoes. Nothing crazy, okay? So the next things we're going to be going over are the characters not duping in the trailer or getting blue screened. The quitting session problem when leaving to creator and then you're supposed to end up online. And easier timing when falling, okay? So we're going to go over all of that in this video. So check it out. We're going to be spawning here in story mode as Franklin. Doesn't matter which online or which story mode character you actually are. But we are Franklin right here. It should work either way. Now, I'm going to go ahead and enter director mode by opening up my interaction menu, pressing up once, and then go ahead and launch director mode. So we're going to be in the trailer now, all right? Remember, you want a bird on the shortlist and you want your GTA character on your GTA Online character on the shortlist. So what I do every time I go into here, into here, this is my process. I go and I just kind of hover over both of these birds. OK, I have one of those on the shortlist by pressing Y or triangle. Then I go over to my online character. I have my first one on the shortlist by pressing Y or triangle. Now I go to my shortlist and check it out. I have the bird on there and I have the online character. Doesn't matter which one's on top or bottom. Doesn't matter. Now. You want to press up and X at the same time or down, doesn't matter. Just you want to press the, the directional pad and X at the same time. So down and, down and X or down and A on Xbox. And it works on both consoles. We've confirmed it. So if, once you're in director mode as your online character, you want to go ahead and return to the casting trailer. All right. Now that we're at the casting trailer, if you did it correctly, you should be hovering over the bird. Now that we're hovering over the bird, just go ahead and you got to be hovering over the bird and looking at your online character. So go ahead and click on the bird. Now we're in director mode as the bird. Go back to the casting trailer. All right, you guys know this stuff. Now, this is where people are having problems. And I guarantee you I have figured out why most people are having problems, okay? So this is what I do. I go to the animals. I go up or I go down once. And then I go back over to animals, over to the actor section. Now I go to the shortlist actors, okay? Well, actually, I kind of just, you know, hover over them a little bit. And then I go back to animals. And uh, now, look at this. I'm actually just going to go ahead and go up and down on these. And you see how slowly I'm going? I'm not fast forwarding it this time. I'm going mad slow because I want to show you guys that I think the, the reason most people are having problems is because they're going super, super fast. This is the only time I go fast. And you're going to see because I want these guys to start splitting apart. So I'm just going to speed it up here in a few seconds. And then it's going to make all of them just kind of, you know, um, just sp split apart a little bit so that they can all start falling off, off that bale of hay. So check it out. I'm still going at this normal speed. I'm not fast forwarding whatsoever, okay? Because this is the reason. So you see that? Now they've all split apart. And look at the speed I'm going at. 
You guys have to realize you're getting blue screen because you're overloading your system. Guys, this the, the PS4 and the Xbox, this isn't easy to handle what we're doing right here. We're glitching the hell out of the game. And right now, this is a lot of stress on the system, man. You're not supposed to be able to do this in this game, all right? Or in any game. We are glitching the hell out of it. You are duplicating these things that aren't meant to be duplicated over and over and over again. It's like if you kept duping a million retros and they were just all out on the street and stuff. It's a lot of processing power for your console to take. So check it out. If you're going too fast, you're obviously putting more stress in the system. And I think that's why you're having more glitchy results and you can't get certain things to actually spawn. You can't get your player to duplicate. You keep getting blue screen on PlayStation or your app keeps closing on Xbox. This, I think, is the main reason. All right. So you see, I'm just going up and down, up and down at a casual pace. All right. Be patient. If you're not, if you're fast forwarding through this part right now, then you're not a patient person. And this glitch is probably not for you. I'm not going to lie to you. You must be patient. Okay. Now, as you can see right here, I'm still being patient and I want these these birds to stop duplicating completely. Okay, and you're going to see how easy I'm able to actually dupe the character and get my character on top of the bale of hay. Okay, I'm telling you, I have I think I have figured it out and this is it. Every time I tried to rush this cuz I was doing this last night, I got an extra two outfits. And I was doing this last night and every time I did this part super fast just to get through it, I ended up screwing it up and something didn't work right. It always happened this way. All right. So I'm telling you, go at this at a casual pace. All right. So uh, that's this is pretty much what I wanted to go over when it comes to this part. But check it out. They're going to stop duplicating here real soon. I think they already have. Actually, I end at the crow. All right. At my top character. So now I go back over to the shortlist actors. and I'm just going to go ahead and press down once. Now I look and check it out. They duplicated right there. You literally saw them duplicate. I went back down once uh, once again. Look at him. He's on top of the bale of hay. Like, go slowly at this. Now you can go over to actors and you can pick the category you want. He's going to spawn over there. And now you can press X or, or square on PlayStation and you can start, you know, going through all the different outfits. Now, remember, what we've confirmed from this is that Christmas mask and the beast mask are are the outfits you're looking for. They must have those items equipped or else they will not transfer online. Halloween masks do not work. We've confirmed that already. They don't. It's only Christmas masks along with the beast mask. All right. Out, they're masks that have been taken out of the game. That's why they're working. All right. Now, apart from that, remember, like that was a Christmas mask. That's the one you want. Now, I'm going to cut forward because I actually failed twice. All right. I found a cool outfit. Didn't get it. Found another outfit. Tried. Didn't get it. So I ended up just going and this is my third attempt. I actually changed my guy to a crew t-shirt and a rebreather. Now I found the outfit I wanted. I'm going to back out of that first menu, go to the online characters and select my first GTA online character. And there we go. And you see he has a Santa mask on. This is what we're looking for. So now we're on to the save method. All right. This is the part a lot of other people are having trouble with as well. This save method. I'm going to show you this. I hit this first try when I use this cheat. Okay. And uh, you know what? The, oh, yeah. First of all, you got to go ahead and enter story mode. So hold down on the D-pad and select a story mode character. Accept the alert. We're going to end up on this black screen. PlayStation, start up a recent activity by hitting start GTA Online and decline the alert. Xbox, join a friend in a different targeting mode. Accept the first alert, decline the second. Now we're all right here. You're off the black screen and you are in story mode. Okay? Get to a tall building. Activate, you know, super jump if you have to to get up there activate this cheat though this is the one you want to activate for sure okay you need to do this part i'm telling you you will get the timing much much better so you see the cheat i just put in slow motion level one you see at the bottom left above the map that is what i just did so now my guy is going in slow motion i'm gonna go ahead and put that cheat in again okay and i'll include this down in the pinned comment and the description for you guys so i put the cheat in again now i'm at slow motion level two all right, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm actually just going to jump off this thing. Now, you see, you can press pause at any time. That's not slow motion. It's just the gameplay. So look, I'm going to jump off and this is with the slow motion cheat. Look how slow he's going. All right, you can even do it again and go level three slow motion if this is too quick for you. But I did this and I'm holding pause right now. OK, so I'm holding pause. I'm holding pause. And right when I think I'm pretty close to the ground, I'm going to go ahead and let go of pause just like that. Hurry up and go to online and go to creator. All right, accept that. Now you're going to see, you saw him kind of get up there. I think that's also the key. When you see him kind of, you know, popping up a little bit, that is another way to know. Now, you see this joining GTA online right here, quitting session? 
uh, or a lot of people are getting quitting session instead of joining GTA Online. You're getting quitting session because you actually needed to go online first and then go to story mode, okay? So go online first before you do the glitch and then go to story mode and check it out. I've spawned in with my outfit. All right, this is the outfit. The Christmas mask is gone. I proven right here. You can get checkerboard, uh, you know, pants. You can get red body armor that you normally can't get. These are things we really can't get normally in the game. Okay, so at this point, you want to go ahead and go to a clothing store, whatever session you spawn into. Go to a clothing store. Once you go to a clothing store, then you can go ahead. I recommend changing accessories. Throw on, you know, certain things. Uh, LCD earpieces. You know, um, the uh, what's that thing called? The rebreather. Get some orange save icons like you just saw at the bottom right. You want to ensure in this session that this thing will stick, okay? And then go ahead and save it onto an outfit slot. Save it a few times if you have to. I know I had to. I actually switched sessions and it hadn't saved in a slot, but I was still equipped with the outfit, so I was actually able to still, you know, keep it because I just resaved it once again. But you guys have to do this, okay? You spent this much time getting the outfit, you need to make sure it actually sticks and saves, okay? So. Be patient. That is the key to this tutorial. And like the thing I want you to leave from is that patience is a virtue and you need it for this glitch. Okay. So here I am in my CEO office with the outfit. And I'm actually going to scroll through and show you all the outfits that I've gotten so far with this glitch. Okay. And I haven't put too much time into it, really. Uh, I was doing other things today, but I wanted to do this right now to show you guys. So check it out. I have that one. I got that one last night, that one last night, those two. And then these were the first two that I got from my first video. Okay. So I've gotten successfully, you know, a few outfits over here. And some of them are pretty cool. Some of them are kind of tacky looking, but it works, guys. It really does work. So, you know, take this tutorial as, you know, as a tutorial and learn from it. What, what do I need you to take away from this is, you know, no rank necessary. You should be able to do it with any rank. Rebreather is optional. Uh, character not duping or getting the blue screen or the bird spawning under you where the dupe character is supposed to be. That is because I, I really do believe that is because you are duping the animals too quickly. Okay. The quitting session problem. That's because you need to go online first and then go back to story mode and do the glitch. Okay. You need to be online before you head to story mode and do the glitch. That's essential. All right. And the easier timing when falling, you can fix that by putting the slow motion cheat in. Okay. That's going to be it for me. I hope you learned something. I really do hope you learned something and enjoyed this video. You know, my name is Roll Easy. Please subscribe to the channel if you're brand new. Turn on post notifications and drop a fat like on this video for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. Road to 25,000 subscribers. Peace out, everybody, and happy glitching. <laughs>